What would make regular stuff way cooler? A pop of color, of course! And with the right paint on hand, you can create some serious masterpieces! Who knows? You may create the next Mona Lisa! Or at least a really cool-looking laptop case! Ready to put on your artist hat? I just need to do some DIY! Hmm, that's not right. It's now screwing in! Can you help me, Jasmine? Well… <laughs> I suppose so. This is gonna be epic! Huh? What's wrong with this? Watch this! Whoa! <laughs> it was a drawing! Hey! What's happening? Whose clothes are these? I'm looking good. Wow! I know, right? It's so cute! Look over there! Hello, my lovelies. Welcome to your drawing challenge. Uh, where does she go? Oh well, I guess we can relax. Mmm, my favorite soda. Nice! I'm looking forward to this. Mmm, that tastes good. Hey, what are you doing? Pick a number. Uh, I'm sorry. Come on, we don't have all day. Let's go for number three. Excellent choice! Oh, a snowflake! Wait, this is timed? We better get started. This should be fun. I'll start with a basic shape. Then fill in the details. Okay, now for the next one. I'll do the same basic shape, but draw some zigzags in the center. That looks good. Okay, what's next? I'll do a little more detail in this one. They say no snowflake is identical. I'm really happy with these drawings. I wonder how Justin is doing. Shh, I'm trying to concentrate. Time is running out. Hold on. There. Oops. It was an accident. I'm sorry. It's going everywhere. No! My drawing's ruined! I'm so sorry! You need to be careful! Hey, look at that! Something's happening! I'll just blow this off! Whoa! What? What's going on? Justin? Where are you? Oops. <sighs> it's so cold! Tell me about it, buddy. Where am I? Beats me. I've been stuck here for years. I'm gonna catch a cold. Can I borrow that? Wait a minute. Bigfoot! Oh! A human! You'll never believe what just happened. Oh, I'm never going outside again. Thanks. So cold. Oh well. That'll teach you. I can't feel my face. And they live happily ever after. Do you mind? I'm listening to the story. You're such a nerd. Luna! Stop hitting the nerd! Bring on the supplies! Whoa! Is this for me? So where's mine? Whoa! Look at all these art supplies! Are you kidding me? This is awesome! Uh, do you mind? You'll need a model. This cute little cat will do. It's perfect! Oh, It's so adorable! I'm ready to create. Hmm, which brush, though? I need something to draw with. These crayons are perfect. Nope. No way. Put them back. We're gonna have a problem. Maybe I should use pens instead. There's too many choices. This is so annoying. Wait. I have an idea. I just need to be sneaky. Just a little further. Huh? Just that cool? Now's my chance! Got him! Ha! <laughs> You're not so smart after all. What am I supposed to do with these? At least I've got a pen. I better get started. First, I'll draw a straight line. Then I'll draw a large number three. Just like this. Next, I'll do the cat's ears. And some whiskers. Finally, a long, curvy tail. Let's add some color. This is looking good. It's time to add the eyes and nose. I'll give my cat some stripes. I'll make these darker. It needs some rosy red cheeks. Pretty cute, huh? That was easy. Hey, you know I finished, right? Oh no! I'm not good under pressure! I need to be quick! Ta-da! 
There's an obvious winner. I'm the judge. And the winner is… Luna! Yes! I knew it! Woohoo! Hey, what do I win? Wait. Something's different? Wow, look at this! Get your hands off my tail! You're a mean kitty! No wonder I'm a dog person! Mmm, look at these marshmallows! I love a good snack! It does look good. I'm so jealous right now. Hey! Get your own! No. Back off. You're mean. It's so not fair. Huh? Oh. Thanks. But what am I gonna do with these? I've got it. This is gonna be epic. I've made a super straw. It was thirsty work making it. So I deserve a treat. Mmm, it's nice. Uh, I'm sure I had more soda than that. And I don't remember that straw. Oh, so it's like that, is it? <laughs> Let's turn up the heat. I hope Liam likes some spice. Gulp. That's not good. Is it getting hot in here? <laughs> Wait a second. Hold still, Liam! Mmm, toasted marshmallows. Does it get any better? Soft, sweet, and gooey. Whoa! <laughs> this is heavy. The next challenge isn't here. I hope it's a glass of water. I want to open it. Wow! Balloons! They're so pretty. Hmm. I think I can use this marshmallow. I'll place it in a bowl. And I'll add some food coloring. I'll go for green. I'll mix it up. Hmm. It looks tasty. I'll do the same with different colors. I'll dip a paintbrush in the yellow bowl. I'll gently dab it onto the paper. Now let's go for the green. Then it can go onto the paper. I want to create a teardrop shape. Now I need a pen. I'll draw lines from the marshmallows. I'll join the lines at the bottom. They look just like balloons. It looks good enough to eat! My mouth is watering. Wow, that's pretty cool. How am I gonna beat that? I don't need any more straws. Whoa, wait. Maybe I can use these after all. Give me that yellow one. I'll dip the end in this colored water. I'll blow it onto the paper. I'll create bubbles and let them pop. This is actually fun. I'll do it all over the paper. Now I'll need a pen. I'll use it to draw the bottom of a balloon and string. I'll do this on all of them. It looks like they're floating away. Don't you just love it? I'm so glad I thought of this. I'm definitely winning this one. There's no competition. We'll see about that. Hmm. Who do I choose? I think Liam gets it! Me? I won? I mean, I knew that. Yes! Hmm. Is that what you're working on over here? I'm not sure. I think it might need something else right over here. Oh, what are you doing? That's my art! I don't want fish! Nonsense. This piece definitely needs these fish. There! You deserve that! Oh yeah, we'll take this then! Oh, that's it! Have some pink! Fine! Here's some green for you, you Grinch! You are the worst! Ugh! You'll have to get through my roller first! Ha <laughs> ha! Oh my gosh, what the heck is going on over here? Oh! That is it! You both need a challenge after this! Into the box! No, no, no! Quick! Run away as fast as you can! Huh? Oh man! We're stuck in our box! Not much to do down here, huh? Yeah, but I kinda like the break. I'm enjoying my snack. Oh my gosh! What is that? The principal! She's here! All right. Pay attention. I'm looking for this puppet phone case, okay? All right. Look, I even have a phone template for you. Phone templates? Man, this doesn't sound very fun. But I'm definitely gonna beat you. We'll see. Hmm. Already have a great idea. Yep. Candies are the solution. As always. I'll start putting them in place on the template. Gotta make sure they're nice and lined up, too. Okay. And then I'll just fill the whole shape of the phone. Now that's what I'm talking about. Well, two can play the being clever game. I've got this mini rolling pin and it's gonna help me win. <laughs> that rhymed. Okay, but now I need my paints. 
I'll just add some orange polka dots on my rolling pin. All the way across in a line. And then onto the next colors. Ooh, this blue is so bright! I absolutely love it! Blue might be my favorite color! Okay, dots are made and now I'm ready to roll! Ha! Look at that! It totally worked amazingly well! Hey! Miss Principal! I'm done with my art! Huh? Oh, right. The artwork. Let me see. Hmm, okay, okay. I see what you did there. Very nice. Now, how about you? Oh, of course. I think you'll be greatly impressed by my work. Oh, shoot. I'm so dumb. I can't believe I just did that. I really had something. I promise. Okay, all right. I believe you. But you're not the winner. She is. I get the phone as a prize? Amazing! Thank you so much! And now I can play with the poppet case, too! Prepping for your art project is all part of the process. A messy one at that. Anyway, time to turn this idea into art. First stroke is always the best. Add a little bit of blue here. It's really coming together. Or is it? This is terrible! Nope! Good thing I have lots more paper! Ooh, smooth. This is worse than the first one! Ugh! Come on now, focus! You've gotta be kidding me. Why can't I paint a stupid flower?! Alright. Stay calm. Deep breath in. I can do this. I am fully capable. It's go time. Easy. Easy. Shoo! Huh? That was unfortunate. But wait a minute. What an interesting shape! I can work with this! Using your paintbrush in different ways can help you create entirely unique designs. And in my case, petals! Once you've gone all the way around, add some green for the leaves and stems. See how it's all coming together? Careful strokes go a long way. You can even attach these two. It fills out the space quite nicely. I knew I could do it! Whoa! You drew all this on your own? Why don't you have it, Annie? I've got more creating to do. And this time, I'm taking a whole new approach. But don't worry, we're still staying on theme here. See how these strokes make the leaves really come alive? Don't be afraid to take your time with these. You can even make grass, see? But the next part gets a little more complicated. I can use some puppy paints like these to create all new fun textures with a balloon! How satisfying was that? Now use it like a stamp. And you'll get these fun, totally unique flowers. Don't forget this one. Cool, right? Awesome! What do you think? <gasps> David! How did you even come up with that? My secret ingredient! You know, you don't just have to paint on paper. In fact, your body can become a canvas. All it takes is a little imagination and some creativity. Black paint and a black background can create some striking artwork. It might not look much just now, but you're gonna be impressed. Any ideas what it is? Okay, are you ready, Ashley? Can I go first, please? Sure, go for it. Thanks! This is so exciting! It's the bunny! See? Are you serious? It's the cat! No! No way! It's the bunny! Stop it! You're mean! I'm only following the rules. If you want to play that way, bring it on. Let's do this. I've been training for this my whole life. Come at me. Ugh, my nose! Oh, I need to do something! That's it! I, I give up! Oh, 
Give me that! Watch this! I'll draw some S shapes on the paper, then join them up. This is gonna be so cute! Can't forget two smiling faces! It's a bunny and a cat! But they need some color. They look so happy! It's so easy to draw this! I'm almost finished! Justin, look at this! They're hugging! Whoa! It's a cat! It's amazing! Aw, it's so adorable! Take that! Wait, what's that? Oh! It looks so cuddly! There's a tiny draft, too! This one's mine! Aww! Okay, I guess this little guy's mine. Heh, <laughs> my draft is much better. Okay, don't move. I need to draw you. So far, so good. What are you doing? I'm examining the draft. Oh, good idea. Hmm. I wonder how Justin's doing. Pretty realistic, isn't it? I'm gonna call him Jerry. It doesn't look like a draft. This is gonna be tricky. It's all about getting the right scale. Hang on. I have an idea. I'll place my hand like this and then draw around it. I'll add a face. And now it's a draft! Let's color it in! This brown is the perfect color. And I can color the rest yellow. Careful! I don't want to make any mistakes now. Now for the neck. That's it! I'm glad I thought of that. Yeah, okay, that's pretty good. Oh, I'm sorry, Jerry. You can have this! Thank you! Okay, the next round! Wait, cover your eyes. Ooh, mysterious! Hehe, <laughs> I'm gonna surprise Ashley. Ugh, that's pretty gross. Ooh, and it smells awful! What's that smell? Sorry. Wait, Justin! I know what we can do! Check this out! I'll start by drawing a tree. Then some apples. Let's add some green leaves. I better stay in the lines. It's looking good! I'll add some dark green for the leaves. It just gives it texture. And of course, the trunk has to be brown. Using vertical pen strokes makes it look like wood. Then we'll color the apples red. They look so juicy! Ta-da! It's an apple tree! It's good, but it's not a real apple. <gasps> Justin, look! Whoa! That's so cool! Mmm, that's so tasty! Try one! I think I will! Think you could draw pizza? One, two, go! Ugh, oh, close! I'll solve this with a spin of the wheel! Who was that? Oh, that was so weird. Oh, look at the wheel! What? Oh, wow! This might be tricky. Mmm, stop! What? Let's make it interesting. One, two, three, go! This is tense. Oh no! My pencil! It's okay, I have another. This isn't going well. Oh, come on! Huh? Oh, unlucky. I don't have time for this! Uh, this is taking too long! Uh, I need to hurry! Time's almost up! Ugh, get out of here! Hey, keep your garbage away from my art! Although, this might be useful. I'll start by drawing a ballerina. This'll look great! She looks so graceful. And I'll use the pencil shavings as the tutu. I'm really happy with this. Hey, Ashley. What do you think? Mm, I wasted so much time! 
But I can still finish my drawing! Just give me a moment! Ugh, careful! Okay, that's it! What do you think? It's good, isn't it? Great job! Look at the timer! We did it! Put it there. Well done. This is fun. Okay, roll them! Aw, I lost. Woohoo! It's my turn to spin! I wonder what we'll get. Ooh, a surprise! Whoa! There's so many things to choose from! Oh, I thought it was candy. What is it? You use it to draw. Ah, got you! Like this? It's fun! What do you think? Uh, okay. Use it like this. It'll make a spiral. All you have to do is move the pen. The circles do the rest. I could do this all day. It looks so cool. Okay, let's try a different color. See? It's creating a different pattern. I don't need these anymore. Now that looks good! Whoa! It's so hypnotic… Ashley? Are you okay? Yoo-hoo! Hey, snap out of it! I know! This might be loud! Ugh. This has to work! Seriously? I'm all out of ideas. Oh. This feather might be handy. Wakey wakey! Achoo! What happened? Oh yeah! My pretty circles! Uh, they look great. Can I spin the wheel? No, it's my turn. Aw. Go on. Settle it with a thumb more? Let's go. This could take a while. Stop! Why don't we both spin it? Good idea! Oh! Sup? This is gonna be epic! Wait, where are we? Maybe we should go. Wow! My first tattoo! Whoa! You're eager! Let's do this! Are you crazy? This is gonna look sick! <laughs> it tickles! Wow! Look at that! That's some of my best work. Uh, that's different. I love it! Keep that away from me! Mommy, save me! Your turn, bro. No way! I'll just use this printout instead. I'll cut the butterfly out of the paper. Then I'll put it face down on my wrist. I need some aftershave to wet it. Now I'll press it against my skin. A pain-free tattoo. It suits me, wow! Ah, uh, no. I feel so pretty! Here I go! Ugh. Shoot, I missed! Here, let me try. Ugh. Boo, I missed two. Just gotta aim. It really shouldn't be this hard to get one in. Whoa, what the heck? Look what it's doing! <gasps> it's totally drawing a picture in that artwork! Ooh, that's not good. Oh no, the teacher is here! What's going on in here? Ugh! What happened to that piece of art? That's it! Art power and go! Whoa! No way! Look at us! Wait, lipstick? Oops, sorry about that. I can fix it. There. <laughs> Much better. Alright, we're totally ready to tackle a drawing challenge! I'll spin the wheel and see what you'll be facing. There we go. Oh, how sweet! A heart. Time to draw love! Yay! I love drawing hearts and love stuff! I know what I'm gonna do. I'll start with the word love. Hmm. Wow, that was a great day. She was so beautiful in that meadow. Okay, now to really zazz this picture up. 
I'll add a little heart and then turn the O into a girl. The V can be another heart, and the E can be the person she likes. So cute! But it needs more color. This heart should be pink. Good. And the little one up here should match too. Okay, now for some more colors. A purple dress. Wow! This is really turning into something special! Time to switch colors! Yellow for their hair! They match! And I think he's wearing a blue hat. Time for some green on his shirt! <laughs> no, I love you the most! These colored pencils will help give them expressions! Ta-da! Alright, students, let's see your artwork, please! Uh huh? What? Oh no! Ew, keep the gum in your mouth, please! Um, what are you doing? Uh, just wait. This is my artwork, I promise. I just need one more moment. Almost done. I'm done! There! Here's my artwork showing love! Phew! Whoa! How did you even do that? Amazing! Oh my goodness! That is very impressive! Hi, Marks! I'm excited to see what's next! Oh, there goes the wheel! There we go. It's landed on Flamingo. Hmm, not exactly the most dynamic. What will you do? A flamingo? I don't think I've ever seen one in real life. Are you kidding me? I don't have high hopes for this challenge. What am I gonna do? They're pink, right? I think so. No, that idea won't work either. Ugh. Ugh. I can't stand it! I don't know what to do! Wait, what the heck is all over my hand? Is that paint? Man, now I've got pink paint all over my hand too! Ugh. Hey, wait a second. I think I have an idea. Let's see what happens if I start with a handprint. Whoa! That's pretty cool! And it gives me an idea too! I'm gonna start by tracing my hand. Now to adjust this outline. Gotta add an eye and beak. I'll color in the beak first, since it's black. And now to fill in the pink everywhere else. So much pink! I'll just keep going back and forth here with the color. It's a lot of pink for sure, but I'm getting there! Ooh, there's a pink highlighter in here. I'll need it. Time to turn my handprint into a tropical bird. I'm gonna turn my thumb into the head of the bird. There's the black beak. Now for the eyes and then the legs. There are skinny yellow legs. And I'm done! Alright, class. Let's see your finished projects for Flamingo. <clears throat> Here's my picture of a flamingo. Here's mine too, ma'am. Just like you asked. I see we have a full body drawing and a head profile. You've both done an excellent job! Oh, right. You had paint all over your hand. Oh, <laughs> yes. Yeah, sorry about that. What do you think we'll get next? All right, you two. Are you ready? It looks like your selection this time is boy. I'm interested to see what you come up with. Hmm. I'm kind of bummed about this one. Not gonna lie. Huh? Oh no! I'm out of snacks! Now that's something to be bummed about. Well, now what am I gonna do? Hang on a second. I've got this empty plate now. Yep, this is totally gonna work. I've got a great plan. What are you even doing over there with that plate and marker? I don't get it. Why are you drawing on the plate like that? Don't worry about me. I know what I'm doing. Gonna just finish up my little stick man on this plate. Hmm, boy. What should I draw for that? I'll try with my words again. That seems to work well for me. Okay, there we go. Boy, now it's time to transform it. Give him some glasses and now some hair. Looking good. Can't forget your ear, though. Or his chin, nose, and mouth. All right, I've got my stick man. I think he needs a balloon, too. There. And he needs a string so the balloon doesn't fly away. Ugh. There's something in my teeth. It's obnoxious. No good. Maybe something to drink will help. Gulp. Hmm. Maybe a little better, I think. I think you need some orange hair. Just a little bit more and your hair will be good to go. All right. You want a green shirt? Sure thing. I'm done! <gasps> no! You spilled water all over my guy! He's drowning! I have to do something to save him! No, no, no! Stickman, don't panic! Wait. Something's happening! Something's going on with my stickman! You're right! He can't drown because it floats! He's so cool! I love him! You did a great job! I win this one? No way! That's amazing! Okay, let's spin this wheel again. Aw, would you look at that! You got dog this time! I know what I'm gonna do. It's in my hat! What? A rubber chicken? Where did this come from? I know it's in here somewhere. 
Wait, is this what I need? Nah, I don't really play that much anymore. Come on, this hat can't be that big. <clears throat> is that a quarter? Is that what you were looking for? Oh, there's one for me too! Don't mind if I do! Phew, who knew my hat could hold so many things? Okay, I need this pen. I don't get it, what are you doing with your coin over there? I'm using it as a tracing guide. I need a couple of circles. I don't get it. Wait, I know what to do! I hope you're all working hard over there! Okay, I'm gonna need my hoodie pulled over my head. I'll be right back. Hey there! How about I give you this and you lend me your dog? Thanks! Oh my gosh! Who's a cute little good boy? <sighs> my name is Patrick. Smile! I just need to get a couple of photos of you. You're so cute! You could be a model! Eee! Here you go! Thanks so much! Got my oval colored in except for that circle. I've added those little lines and dots. Now to draw his head. And some eyes, too. He's really starting to come together. Can't forget his ears, of course. A doggy needs his ears. And a body, too. And finally, his tail. Now to color him in. I think his ears need to be a brown color. And his feet and cheeks. Done! Phew! I made it back and no one noticed I was gone. Just gonna finish up right here. <laughs> Teacher, I'm done! Here's my picture of a dog! I'm done, too! Oh my gosh, look at that cute little angel face! You win! She didn't even draw that! We're ready for our next challenge! Oh, I love dance! Looks like you've got a ballerina! Wait, what? How are we supposed to work with that? Don't look at me, I've never even seen a ballet! Wait, I know! I'll need this paper. I can fold it in half like this. What are you doing over there, origami? That can be pretty neat. I know, but you have to make sure to fold the paper just right. I started with a center fold like this. Then again the other way. Open it up, fold down both the corners. Good. Then the bottom flap needs to come up on both sides. Yeah, this is going great so far. I love folding paper. These popped up corners need to go back down. Corners over here, too. Just a little more. Getting closer. These sides both have to fold up. There! I did it! I made a little boat out of my piece of paper! What do you think? Do you like it? There! Perfect! A pair of little paper sails for my boat. But how is it for dance? Oh, because a boat dances along the waves as it sails. Wait, what? That's seriously what you're going with? That's totally not gonna work! She's right, see? The picture is on a ballerina, not a boat. Uh, okay, fine. But I think I can still do something with origami. Are… are you just making another boat? Because again, won't work. No, it's not another boat. Look, I made a unicorn this time. Woo! You've got a unicorn! You're amazing! <laughs> Still isn't gonna count. Okay, you're right, but I've got this. Third time's the charm. I'll use two colors of paper this time. That'll help for sure. Hmm, what are you doing? Wow, this is hard. How are you doing that? You're going so fast! It's hard to keep up! Yes, I'm done! I made a beautiful rose! For you. It's so lovely! I can't believe you made this for me! But what the heck am I gonna do? <gasps> I know! I just need to start over with my folds. I'm gonna use the edge of this ruler to help keep my folds crisp. This part is a bit tricky. Gotta pop it out like this. And on the other side, too. Okay, I need to add some artwork. Just gotta draw a cute little ballerina on my paper. She's so cute! Okay, but I need to draw other parts, too. Gotta make sure she still has her face and hands here. And then do the same on the other side, too. Once I'm done up there, I need to do the same thing with her leg flaps. I think I'll give her some colors so she's prettier. But I can't forget to color it on each of the flaps. And I think I'll finish her outfit with a blue tutu. That's cute! Blue over here and blue over there. Yes! I'm finished with mine! Ta-da! Here, let me show you how it works. If I take the flaps and fold them up and down, I can make her dance! Hmm, <laughs> look at her go! So beautiful! Whoa! Wow! What a spectacular job! You win! Yes! I knew I would! But… Check out my new book! You watch too much TV, dude. Give your brain some exercise. What does that mean? Whoa! How did we get here? Challenge accepted! You mean a drawing challenge. Sounds good to us! I have a good rose. And for your very first challenge… We're drawing a goose. Think you can do better? Hey! Wow! 
I can do that! So cute! Now, where do I begin here? Yes! It's all about the angle of the pen. What you drawing over there? I want to see your technique, okay? Stop covering it! <sighs> what can I use here? This hand is suddenly very inspiring! And I know just what to use it for! First, trace all around your fingers. The thumb is the head. And the hand is its body. Can't forget the cute little feet. See how color makes all the difference? This goose is a happy yellow. Brown works well for the feet. Almost there! Phew! Okay, let's see him. It's a goose, see? My turn? Well, what do you think? They're both pretty spectacular. This goose sure is making a splash. <laughs> Feels good! Ready, kids? Hey. Whoa! So cute! And he's wearing a little sweater! Let him serve as your muse. Ready, set, draw. Okay, let's see here. Gotta get this just right. Stay nice and still, okay? Ugh, I just can't get this right. Wait, where are you going? There's one dog I know how to draw. Well, it's more like the word dog. I can definitely draw that, but doesn't look too interesting. Actually, maybe I can work with this. First, turn the D into ears. See the doggy face now? Aw, look at this nose! Now it's coming together, see? And now for the body. And the color really makes him come alive! Brown dogs are particularly adorable! Done? Oh yeah! Show me those pups, people! So cute! Great job! But I drew Super Dog! So cute! This is a tough call! But Gina's the winner! Yes! <laughs> Where's my Abracadabra? A rose I have a How do you do that? Pretty cool, don't you think? It's totally real! Look at it! There you go, little rose! I need to see it too, Brian! Just look at those petals! Oh yeah! I hear you loud and clear! The rose has spoken, and I'm officially inspired! Watch these petals go, baby! And the colors really make it pop! See the different texture here? Now it really comes alive off the page! Never underestimate line drawing! So simple, yet brilliant! Now for a little bit of shading. The shadowing really makes a difference. But it does take some time, so patience is key. It's all about retracing your lines and dots. And also filling in any space. And done! Just in time! Show me what you got! Cool, huh? Do I have to? I only got the stem. Well, that's too bad. Brian? What? Okay, fine. You can have my flower, Gina. Thank you! Gonna Frankenstein this thing! There! Marvelous! It's like you two complete each other! You're both winners in my book. Kind of. Oh, it's time again? What can I come up with here? Ta-da! We can do that, right? Nah, that's not right. Oh, Gina. Got it! That's a stupid idea. Yes! See this? It's the key to my great idea. Whoa! I'm gonna do something else. First, start simple, then connect those lines. 
It's really starting to come together now. Now it's all about those tiny details. Wouldn't be a hand without those. Finished, are we? Brian, time's up. Brian? Oh, here you go. It's, uh, something. Vegeta's. Now that's what I call art. Really? I'm a real artist! And mine? High five! On second thought. I won! I won! Mmm, so good. Anyway, I spy some eyes. Cover them up. Yep, this next challenge ought to be fun. Okay, hey! This is the challenge, see? Yes! This is the best one yet! We love us some poppins! Now I know it'll be the right size. And I've got my colors ready. One purple coming right up. Purple row, done. What the? There, it's ready. Careful. Ha! I know. Time to get serious. Brian, what's that thing for? You'll see soon enough. Ooh. That's right, I have cool. And this is how it's done. Paint little dots along the rod. Make more in another row. And in a whole new color. Do all the colors of the rainbow. Almost finished here. And this is where the magic happens. Before it has time to dry, roll it on out. Gina, check this out! This is how you do it. Nicely done. But Brian, now that's what I call a masterpiece! Just call me the Poppet King. Thank you. Thank you very much. Boom! It's time for Extreme Drawing Challenge. Two contestants will compete for one million dollars. The loser will be punished. We have David and Ellie. Let's see how they're doing. Hmm. Maybe if I try this. What's next? Oh, what's David doing? Got it. I'll draw some eyes and a mouth. It's looking cute. Now for the ears. And a fluffy tail. I better add some details. I'm pretty happy with this. I really need to finish this. Oh no! My pencil! I need to be quick! So much pressure! Hmm, maybe I got carried away. It'll still work. I should add some color. Come on! Whoa! Let's all take a deep breath. Let that tension melt away. Feels good, huh? Let's see what they're drawing. Aw, it's just adorable. A cute little bunny. And how did our contestants do? It's a little rushed. Sorry. It's a masterpiece, huh? Aw, it's amazing! Didn't they do well? Thanks! But who won this round? Oh, I know. It's a tough one. And this round goes to… David! No! Yes! What? For real? But my drawing's actually good! What can I say? So unfair! Ugh. Ooh, such rage! <gasps> Why are you looking at me like that? Eh, who cares? <laughs> Woohoo! Ellie, it's punishment time! Ugh, I'm so mad! Balloons? What's going on? I guess I have to pop them? This isn't so extreme. Here goes! Ooh! So tense! Huh? Okay, the next one! <gasps> this isn't so bad! I think that color suits her. <laughs> this is messing up my hair! <laughs> you look ridiculous! <laughs> Be quiet, David! Achoo! Uh, 
Look at Brian! <laughs> Payback! Oh, it's good fun! <laughs> she got you good! David is our winner! Ellie is the loser! Okay, I'm on a roll! I need to win this round! They both look focused! This is tricky! You can do this! I'm really happy with this drawing! These colors are so vibrant! What's happening, guys? Let's check out David's artwork. Hmm, not looking good. Right here, dude. Get that out of my face! Ha! He's so angry! Look at this by Ellie! This would look good in any garden. Wow! Awful! Thanks, Brian! That is pretty good. But I have an idea. I'll add some more lines. Now for the leaves and stem. Every rose has thorns. A few more leaves. And a splash of color. Oops. I better stay in the lines. Can't forget the green in the leaves. There. Even a florist would be happy with that. Wow! He's a natural! You're too kind. Nice try! Wow! Two different roses, two different styles! What do you guys think? Well, Ellie's a striking, but David's fine! David! Ellie! No! This is close! Ellie! David! It's a tie! No way! There's one way to decide! Is it Ellie? Or is it David? Leave your winner in the comments below! Ooh, thanks! Wait, seriously? Vote Ellie! No, vote David! It's still neck and neck! You're kidding me! Look! I won again! Thank you! David, congratulations! You win again! This is a fix! Better luck next time! I get punished again? But goodbye, everyone! I love you all! You can do this, Ellie! I'm ready! Stay strong! Please be gentle. I have my little red button. Do it! Ugh, it smells so bad! Oh, it's such a shame! Ugh. So gross! I could watch this all day. Is this mustard and ketchup? Just what I need. Thanks. I'm getting used to this. I don't like this game. Okay, I'll start by drawing some sixes. Then some bigger ones. And connect them up. Some eyes, a nose, and a mouth. I'll start on the paws. A bow tie will make this teddy look smart. This brown is perfect for my teddy. And a lovely red bow tie. I wish I had this teddy. So do I. I mean, uh, I want to see. It's good. Ooh, I need to see this. What's all the commotion? Whoa! Awesome! Look at this! What do you have, David? Not a lot, it seems. The pressure. It's too much. We know who's winning this round. Was David always this fluffy? Ugh! Where did he go? Don't look at me! He's around here somewhere! Where is he? Hey! Who's this guy? Aha! Come on, Jake! Why, you! Ellie, show off your pretty drawing! Woohoo! They love it! David, you're mine! What's the worst that can happen? You're gonna need these! This isn't a good sign. Boom! Oh! Ooh, that's not a good look. Ha! <laughs> it's deserved! It's so sticky! Ha <laughs> ha, so funny! Get it off me! Yay! I won! Woo! What do we do? A little help? What is this? I have no idea. Focus! 
Come on, guys. Think of the money. <sighs> I need to do something. Got it. Oh, no. David started. Ellie, Ellie. Oh, you're so sweet. Almost done. What's he doing? Wait, that's not right. <sighs> Gotta start again. <gasps> Now's my chance! Whoa! What's he doing? Let's see that again. Look! That's a terrible drawing. <laughs> Boo! I tried. Okay, watch this. I'll draw a loop around the zeros. Oh, okay, I know. This isn't so difficult. It just takes some imagination. Some whiskers. Now I'll connect it to the two. I'm nearly finished. I'll color these parts in. It's a sleepy cat! Ta-da! Oh, come on! I love it! Okay, I need to think! Woo! David! Thanks, babe. Right back at ya. This is getting weird. You lose! Oh. And this lovely lady is our winner! Ellie! David, if you would be so kind. Whatever. Okay, let's get it over with. What? What is this? You're gonna find out! Is that Mentos? Hold on, does that mean… Oh no! No way! Ooh. Where… where am I? Refreshing! Ellie is our winner! Who has won the million dollars? Will it be David or Ellie? It's a tie! Yes! Woo! It's been a great contest, so it's only right you share the money. Wow, thanks! I'm rich! I'm gonna buy so much candy! Woohoo! This is the best day ever! I'm keeping this. Well done, Ellie. You were great! Hey, everyone! I have a great new game to play! Yeah! We're in! Let's all play! Alright, so I just need to start drawing a picture on his back. Okay, I think I can tell what he drew. I need to draw the same thing. Oh, I totally can tell that he drew a heart. <laughs> I love drawing poop! It's so fun! All right, let's see the pictures! How did you get poop? Woo! Hello, everyone! Um, does anyone know that weird girl over there? Weird girl? What the heck? She just disappeared our friends! You two! You're the two I'm looking for! Let me just separate you! A lightning bolt? How is she doing this? Yeah, that looks good! This swing is so much fun! And it's comfy, too! I know, and wait a second! Hello! Did you miss me? Hi, and no, not really. Well, how about we turn this relaxation into art time? Uh, what are you talking about? What are we supposed to draw? Oh, that? Here, I want you to draw this ladybug. Aw, it's so cute and pretty! Right, Alex? It's competition, so go! A competition? Well then, I'm gonna win! Ah! What the heck, Alex? Ugh! <laughs> Take that, Gabby! I'm definitely gonna win! <laughs> wait, wait a second. Where did she go? Ah, I got you, Alex! I got you! Ah, get off me! You're like a demented monkey! Ha! <laughs> I got away from you! Huh? Ouch! Ugh, where did that ray come from? <laughs> you should have watched where you were going! Stop! Alex, look right there! Huh? Oh, my shoelace! Thanks for the heads up! Now's my chance to pull ahead of him! Yes! I made it first into the art room! I better start drawing! 
Okay, shoelace is tied. You totally took advantage of my shoelace problem. Whoa, what the heck? You're so far on your drawing already. I'm totally gonna win this competition. Well, I guess I need to start drawing then. I've got my pen. I'm gonna begin by drawing a capital letter A. And now I'll draw a circle around it from one end to the other. And then my little beetle needs a head and eyes. Oh, can't forget to add the antenna. Next up, I need to finish the body. I'll add some stripes. And then it's onto the dots. Let me fill in the black color next and the yellow body. And of course, we need the red shell. All right, that should be long enough. Let me see what you've got! Oh, I'll show you all right. Take a look at this. Well, here's my picture. Yeah, that's not good at all. I'm not impressed. Let me take a look at how you've done, Alex. Wow! That's a fantastic drawing! Good job! You're the winner of this round of the competition! Yes! I'm the winner! I'm the best! Take that, Gabby! <laughs> Aw, don't feel too bad. Ugh. Ugh. Whoa! It took me forever to find you! Oh, it stinks in here. What the heck are you doing? I'm in the bathroom here! Well, I have the next challenge for you. Uh, I'm listening. I want you to draw a snake for me. Okay, I think I can handle that. Any questions for me? No, I don't have any questions. Are you sure? Jeez, come on. Fine. I can't believe this happened. All I wanted was some privacy. Ridiculous. Wait a second. I've got this toilet paper. And a marker. Snake time! Whoa! Oh, there you are! I've been looking for you! Um, yeah, I'm right here, trying to do some work. Anyway, I need you to draw me a snake. Okay, yeah, I can handle that. Okay, here's your timer! Get drawing that snake! Huh, I've gotta start drawing! It's just a snake. That can't be too hard to draw, right? Wow, that is… a long snake. Here's my snake. Look at how wiggly he is. Are you kidding me? It's on toilet paper! No! What do you have for a drawing? Perfect timing because I just finished. Here it is! Oh, oh my gosh! I thought it was real for a second there! One point for you! Yes! I got my first point! Now we're tied! Well, whatever. Maybe I can finally get out of this bathroom. Did you hear that? I'm finally out! All right, I have to go. Hey, Gabby, check out my snake. She totally hated it. Really? Because it's such a great snake. I love it. You totally deserve to win. How did you do it? Actually, I can show you. Okay, you want to start with a little oval at the top. And then draw a wavy line from there down. Then double it up, but before you reach the end. Next, you're gonna want to fill out the other side of the line, too. Okay, next we'll want to erase that center line and draw the outline with a pen. This is by far the easiest part of the drawing. There we go! Next we want to add lines around all the inside curves. Then add some more lines. That's the underneath of the snake. Don't forget to add eyes and nostrils for our slithery friend, too! Now we can start adding pencil for shading. Darker on the edges and then fading to white in the middle. Oh, I see! Wow, Gabby! So cool! High five! <laughs> this movie's so funny! Hey, you two! I've been looking for you! Come on! We're in the middle of watching a movie together! Uh, what's with the attitude? Anyway, draw my next picture. I want a rose. And I'm so tired of this drawing competition! Wait a second! I actually have a great idea! Wait, Alex! Well, I guess I better start drawing then. I'll start by drawing a red heart. And then I'll add some mountain shapes inside the heart. Then I can draw a swoop below. That'll be the body of the flower. And then one more petal line off to the side. Next, I'll need to add some green leaves, of course. It's looking great so far. I think it needs a stem, though. Aw, what a nice-looking little flower! I love it! I need a flower, like, right now. Oh, sure, just be here. Oh yeah, yeah. I can help you. Great. I'll just follow you this way then. Okay, so I need a flower because I have to draw it for this weird competition. A rose, preferably. A rose? Hmm, let's check over there. I might have something. Here we have some lovely apples. Don't they smell wonderful? Dude, apples won't cut it. I really need a rose or at least a flower. You can see the new area of the garden over here. I mean, this is a nice tour, but I still need that flower. Oh my gosh, that's the perfect rose! Yes, it is. Perfect! I'll take it! Sure, but you'll need to pay me. 
Oh, of course. But listen, could you close your eyes like this? Okay. He did it! Now's my chance! Yoink! Hey, Gabby. Oh, wow. That's a nice-looking rose you drew there. Aw, you really think so? I'm pretty pleased with it. Yeah, it looks like the real thing. Great colors. But, oh, she's coming back. Oh, I ended up facing the wrong way. All right, what have you got? Here's a flower I drew. I hope you like it. Oh, I see. It's very nice indeed. You get one more for that. What? No way! Yes! And you, Alex? Well, I've got something even better than a drawing of a rose. <gasps> oh my gosh! You got that just for me? That's right I did. Just for you. Here you go. Oh my goodness. Well, I accept. It smells so gorgeous! Only the best for you! <laughs> One point for you as well! Yes! Thank you! And call me? Oh, Alex! I'm sitting right here! Ooh, things look rough. I'll be going now! I can't believe you did that! Gabby, wait! I only did that to get rid of her! What? See? I got one for you too! You got me a rose? Aw, well you're lucky it smells so nice. I don't smell the aroma of my roses anymore! What the heck? He totally bamboozled me! Ugh. Well, I guess it's my own fault, really. And so I told her that she needed to get under control if… Hi, you two! Ha! <laughs> you should see the looks on your faces! But down to business! It's time for another art challenge! <laughs> catch! How were we supposed to catch those? They went everywhere! Okay, start drawing! But she didn't tell us what to draw this time. It doesn't matter. Crud! My pencil lead broke. I'll just use another one then. Ugh, oh, this one broke too! These are terrible pencils! I just got my nails done. I can't even pick them up! Gabby, what are we supposed to do about this? Whoa, Alex! Look at the pencil leads on your paper! I think I can work with them. In fact, I just got a great idea! I'll just flip my hand over and push the lead under my fingernails. One color for each nail, of course. This is the last one. Ta-da! Now it's time to try making some art. Yes! It's working! I turned my fingers into colored pencils! I can't believe how cool this turned out! Pencil nails! Who would have ever thought? And there we go. My picture is completed. Janice! I… Oh. I guess I'm here now. All right, let's see what you managed to draw while I was gone. Ugh. Well, this is all I got done with those shabby pencils. What? That's not even a drawing, Alex. It's like three circles. And you, Gabby? Well, I drew this little sailboat on the ocean. I think it's pretty cute. You're right. It is cute. One point for you. Yes! I'm the winner! I have the most points overall!